The National University of Malaysia abbreviation, UKM, Malay, University Kebangsaan Malaysia, abbreviated UKM is a public university located in Bundar Baru Bangi, Selangor which is at south of Kuala Lumpur. Its teaching hospital, University Kebangsaan Malaysia Medical Centre UKMMC is located in Cheras and also has a branch campus in Kuala Lumpur. It is one of the most prestigious university in Malaysia and Southeast Asia. There are 17,500 undergraduate students enrolled, and 5,105 postgraduate students, of which 1,368 are foreign students from 35 countries. National University of Malaysia is one of six research universities in the country. It was ranked number 259th in the world by QS World University Rankings in 2014. It is ranked 98th place in the 100 best new universities established within the last 50 years in the world. It is the only university from Malaysia that made it in the 2012 Kwakwareli Simmons QS Top 50 Universities Under 50 Years Old list ranked in the 31st place. It placed 56th and 56th in the QS Top 500 Asian University Rankings in 2014 and 2015 respectively. It is ranked at 184th position in world in the 2019 QS World University Rankings making it a top-tier university internationally. History University Kebangsaan Malaysia, the National University of Malaysia was born from the aspirations of the nationalists to uphold the Malay language as a language of knowledge. The quest for a national university was suggested in 1923 by the writer Abdul Qadir Adabi as a move against British colonisation. This nationalist tide galvanised Malay intellectuals of the time but met British suppression. The nationalists never wavered and in 1969 the movement again blossomed. A sponsoring committee chaired by Syed Nasir Ismail, a Malay intellectual, was set up to prepare a report recommending the establishment of UKM. Other prominent members of this committee include Dr. Mahathir Mohamad Tun, Malaysia's fourth prime minister who was then the education minister, and Dr. Maud Rashdan Haji Baba, who later became UKM's first vice-chancellor. University Kebangsaan Malaysia opened its doors on 18 May 1970 to 192 undergraduate students in Jalan Pantai Baru, Kuala Lumpur, a temporary campus housing three main faculties, the Faculties of Science, Arts and Islamic Studies. In October 1977, UKM moved to its present premises which form the main campus in Bangui. The campus has a size of 1,096 hectares 2 acres, situated in the metropolis encompassing the Kuala Lumpur International Airport, Kuala Lumpur, the main commercial centre, and Putrajaya, the administrative capital. The UKM Bangi campus is 45 kilometers 28 miles from KLIA, 30 kilometers 19 miles from Kuala Lumpur and 20 kilometers 12 miles from Putrajaya. UKM has two health campuses, the Kuala Lumpur campus in Jalan Raja Muda Abdul Aziz, and the UKM Medical Center in Cheras. The Kuala Lumpur campus consists of the faculties of health sciences, pharmacy, dentistry and the pre-clinical departments of the medical faculty. With a size of 20 hectares 49 acres, the Kuala Lumpur campus was established in 1974. The campus in Cheras consists of the Medical Faculty, the UKM Teaching Hospital and the UKM Medical Molecular Biology Institute The Cheras campus was opened in 1997. Besides these campuses, UKM operates seven research stations RS, the Tasik Chini RS, the Marine Ecosystem RS, the Longkawi Geopark RS, the Marine RS, the Fraser's Hill RS, the Plant Biotechnology RS and in the main campus itself, the UKM Campus Living Laboratory, which comprises the UKM Permanent Forest Reserve, or its Malay name, Hutan Simpan Kekal UKM as well as the Fernarium and the Herbarium. Based on a foundation of 30 years of research, UKM was awarded the status of a Malaysian research university in October 2006 by the Ministry of Higher Education, a move designed to propel the four public universities into leading research universities in line with the Higher Education Strategic Plan 2007-2020. The year 2006 also saw UKM winning the Prime Minister's Quality Award. 
This award vindicates UKM's efforts at quality education and management, as outlined by the objectives of the UKM Strategic Plan 2000-2020 PS2020. The strategic plan has been augmented by the newly unveiled UKM Knowledge Ecosystem Transformation Plan, a transformation set to catapult UKM into the League of Leading Research Universities by 2018. Academics Faculties Social Science and Humanities established in 1970 as Faculty of Arts Science and Technology established in 1970 as Faculty of Sciences Islamic Studies established in 1970 the three above make up the founding faculties Medicine Health Sciences Dentistry Economics and Management Education Engineering and Built Environment Information Science and Technology Pharmacy Law Graduate School of Business Topic Service Center Chancellery Office Department of Registrar Department of Bursary Department of Development and Maintenance Center for Corporate Communications Center for Quality Assurance Center for Research and Instrumentation Management Center for Collaborative Innovation Center for Teaching and Learning Technologies Center for Information Technology Center for International Relations Center of Risk Management, Sustainability and Occupational Health Rosh Graduate Center Strategy UKM Students and Alumni Affairs Sports Center UKM Library UKM Press UKM Islamic Center UKM Medical Center UKM Children's Specialist Hospital Permatapantar National Gifted Center Office of the Legal Advisor and Integrity Topic Institutes Fuel Cell Institute -E -E Institute for Environment and Development Listari Institute for Malaysian and International Studies IKMAS Institute of Ethnic Studies Kita Institute of Microengineering and Nanoelectronics IMAN Institute of Climate Change IPI Institute of Systems Biology INBIOSIS Institute of the Malay World and Civilization ATMA Institute of Visual Informatics IVI Institute of Islam Hadhari HADHA RI UKM Medical Molecular Biology Institute UMBI Solar Energy Research Institute SERI Institute of Ear Hearing and Speech I hears Topic Residential Colleges College Aminuddin Baki CAB College Burhanuddin Helmi KBH College Dato on KDO College Ibrahim Yaqub KIY College IBU Zain KIZ College Karis Moss KKM College Pendita Zaba KPZ College Rahim Kajai KRK College Tun Drive Ismail KTDI College Tun Hussein on KTHO College Tun Syed Nasir KTSN College Unku Omar KUO Topic Notable Alumni YB Dato Haji Mode Rashid bin Hasnan, Deputy Chief Minister One of Penang, Sheikh Muzaffar Shukor, country's first astronaut, Syed Hussein Alatas, Academic, Anthony Lok Su Fook, Minister of Transport of Malaysia, Leo Tiang Lai, former Minister of Transport, Tan Sri Drive. Jamila Mahmood, Chief of the Humanitarian Response Branch, United Nations Populations Fund UNFPA in New York Anwar Ibrahim, former Deputy Prime Minister of Malaysia and, later, Head of the Opposition Anwar Fazal, Father of Malaysian NGO Movement, Honorary Doctorate in Law, 1997 Datuk Razali Ibrahim, Deputy Minister in the Prime Minister's Department read law. Dato Halimi Abed Manif, Deputy Secretary General of Ministry of Defense Ramlan bin Ibrahim, Diplomat, Permanent Representative of Malaysia to the United Nations Jess Lee, Singer Muhammad Fuzzy Harun, 11th Inspector General of Royal Malaysian Police since 4 September 2017 Neni Shushida binti Shamsuddin, one of the two female Syriya High Court judges in Malaysia
Topic Rankings. When the Times Higher Education Guide University Rankings the was published in October 2014, it was reported that UKM, along with University Malaya, opted to not submit data for consideration. UKM Strategic Centre Deputy Executive Director Associate Professor Dr. Mastra Markham responded to the snub by saying that the rankings were unfair to the Malaysian education context. She specifically cited the measurement of industry income. In the, the methodology of university assessment, stating that Malaysian industry input cannot compete with other countries such as the United States of America. This is despite the fact that only a 2.5% weightage is allocated to industry income in the methodology, and more conventional categories such as teaching and research still makes up 90% of the methodology. See also UKM Medical Center PATMA Library <laughs>